I don't know. I got I got two and a third. I got three routers that I could switch to, but it just takes some time. I'd have to like end my stream and do a bunch of extra shit. Yeah, me too. I know what you're saying. Right, but I'd have to do that for like tomorrow or next stream, bro. If if yeah, you if gotta it, switch it up. You can't do it right away. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. That's, he did you again? He got you again? Yes, bro. Like, this kid's a faggot. No! Yo! It's your boy, DJ, aka Big Head City, in this bitch. And the clip that you just seen was the final clip to get Aiden banned from Twitch. He said the word that rhymes with maggot. The thing that doesn't make any sense to me is the fact that, look, okay, he said a slur, and I get that, and I understand that, okay? The ban in that aspect was all right, but the the indefinite ban, and I I don't know I don't think I don't think it should be indefinite that he got banned for saying that. And on top of that, he didn't even say it on his stream. He said it on somebody else's stream. And the thing is about this entire thing is like this. Look, okay, this indefinite ban. They're getting rid of all their top creators. It doesn't make any sense to me, bro. And if they keep getting rid of their top creators, they're eventually gonna go to another source to stream or somewhere to upload content. Like YouTube, a competitor. You don't think YouTube wouldn't take Aiden Ross or anyone else that they banned? And this is the other thing, look, man. I could also bring up the other stuff that people got banned, you know, that should have got banned for a lot more indefinite. But I'm not gonna bring that up because it, it gets brought up every single time something like this happens. Clearly, everybody sees that Twitch plays favorites. And to be honest, it's it's only a matter of time before people just start not using Twitch at all as a platform. The other problem is like, the only time Twitch reacts to things like this, I feel like, because this was a delayed reaction. Like this didn't just happen the same day that he said it. This happened, this ban came days later which is really weird it was like i feel like twitch waits for a like a public reaction like a backlash to come and then they react because i feel like if this was like a nobody or if this you know nobody said anything about this nothing would have happened it would have fallen on deaf ears but since you know everybody got riled up and i'm not saying that what he did wasn't wrong because it definitely was i'm just saying that look man the the delayed reaction kind of weird that he got banned for saying it on somebody else's stream for you know indefinitely i just think the indefinite part was wrong because people have gotten banned for doing much worse things than just saying a slur and it wasn't indefinite but that's just my listen that's just my take on this goddamn thing shenanigans whatever that's going on on the goddamn internet hope you guys like this video like comment subscribe and your boy dj aka big Ed city is out this bitch take care you and me we vibing catch a train in the next city feel like i'm top island just the way that girl is sticking to me my old girl she wildin don't know why she keep on calling me you go answer the phone no my ex she plotted on killing